Good afternoon, everybody. Good afternoon. How are you? Good, good. How are you? I'm fine. Good, good. I'm glad to hear that. Waiting for the class. Excellent. Um, sorry, guys. I was having a little bit of trouble coming in, but um, but I got it solved right now. Uh, all right. Good, good. Hello, Pedro. How are you? Good. Yeah. Very good. Good. How yeah. was your day today? Today, fantastic. Excellent. I'm glad to hear that. Very, very good. Very good. Okay. Thank you. And uh, hello, Teresa. How are you? Hello, teacher. Fine. Yeah. Okay. Good. How was your day today? Good. Yeah. You had a good day. Yes. Yes. Oh, good. 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 I'm glad to hear that. Excellent. And hello, Guillermo. Hello, teacher. Hi, how are you? Hi, and you? Yeah. I'm good, thank you. Thank you for asking. How was your day? How was your day? Sorry, can, can you hear me okay? Guillermo, can you hear me okay? Uh, uh, ¿Me good. escucha? Sí, sí, sí. Okay. Poco se corta de repente, pero sí la escucho. Ah, okay, okay. Perdón, quizás mi conexión no está tan, tan buena. Okay, are you okay? Uh, everything was is good today? Good, good. Yeah? Yes. Okay, good, excellent. Hello, Douglas, how are you? Hello, teacher. I'm okay. Yeah? Okay, I'm glad to hear that. How was your day today? How was your day today? Quizás, está, quizás mi conexión no está tan buena. Eh, Douglas, can you hear me okay? Yes. Yeah? Okay. How was your day today? How was today, this day? How, how was it? Was it good, good day? Douglas, me escucha. Hola, Douglas, me escucha. Hola. Hola. ¿Me escucha bien o, o, o no me escuchan muy bien? Mm, no mucho. Eh, ok, ¿y los demás me escuchan bien o, o será que estoy teniendo problemas ahí con... Con la conexión. Yo la escucho bien, Tisha. Ah, ok, ok. A mí, a, a mí de, de repente. Wifi, no. De repente que se va, pero, pero estoy cortado, pero ahí está. Lo que pasa es que está por llover, me imagino que por eso no se escucha bien en algunos sitios. Aquí está lloviendo donde yo, yo estoy. Oh, ok, ok, ok. Ok, perfecto. Bueno, ya entiendo. No es que preguntaba si tal vez era mi conexión o, o quizás era, no sé, estaba, estaba, estaba un poco preocupada por eso, pero ya, ya veo qué está pasando. Entonces, ok. Um, all right, very good. Um, ok, guys, so what we're going to do, we're going to start with the attendance. So, if you can please... Um, Oh, welcome, Raúl. Welcome. Hello, Raúl. How are you? Fine. Yeah? Okay, good, good, good. Excellent. I'm glad to hear that. 
eh, veo, veo que, que va de camino. Sí, en unos cinco minutos me conecto ya en la compu, en la casa. Ok, no hay problema, pero gracias ahí por, por, um, por haberse conectado, aunque sea desde su, eh, desde su um, dispositivo móvil. Le agradecemos bastante. Ok, so uh, what we're going to do is uh, we're going to take attendance right now. Ok, so please listen to for your name. Ok. Um, okay, un momentito. Okay, here we go. Uh, Carlos Armando Durán. Carlos Armando Durán. No. Eh, Douglas Enrique Genoves. Douglas Enrique Genoves. Okay. Present. Okay, very good. Excellent. Um, Eduardo Alexander Alvarado. Eduardo Alexander Alvarado. Okay. Um, Eric Fernando Enriquez. Eric Fernando Enriquez. Fabricio Leonardo Zavala. Present. Excellent. I'm um, Gladys Marina Luna. Ladis Marina Luna. <coughs> eh, Guillermo Enrique Acosta. Present. Present. Okay, very good. Jose Eduardo Cruz. Jose Eduardo Cruz. Um, Leila Arminda Valladares. Leila Arminda Valladares. Pedro Miguel Rodríguez. Present. Pe okay, very good. Present. Rafael Antonio Marroquín. Rafael Antonio Marroquín. Raúl Alfredo Castaneda. Present. Raúl, ok. Sara Beatriz Valencia. Sara, Sara Beatriz Valencia. Uh, Susana Guadalupe Navas. Susana Guadalupe Navas. Eh, Teresa de Jesús Pérez. Present. Ok, very good. And Wilmer Andrés Melara. Wilmer. Andres Melara. Okay. All right. Thank you, guys. Um, all right. Um, hello, Fabricio. Hola, Fabricio. Hello. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Um, okay, good. Yeah, I see. Es que no lo miramos. <laughs> okay, very good, very good. Um, okay. Um, okay, so um, we are going to start. So last class, we were looking at food, right? We were looking at different types of food. And what we're going to do right now, um, I want you to tell me if you can see my screen. Okay, can you see my screen?
Está cargando ahorita. Hoy sí. ¿Ya? Yes. Ok. All right, very good. Um, ok, so. Um, we were looking at the U.S. The U.S. has eggs. Everybody, can you repeat after me? For, for breakfast, the U.S. has eggs. Repeat. Eggs. 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 Mm -hmm. Bacon. 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 Toast with butter. 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 Orange juice. Orange juice. Coffee. Or coffee. coffee. Jam. 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 And jelly. And jelly. 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 Okay, very good. Any questions about the vocabulary there? No. Okay. All right. Now in Japan, they have fish. Can you repeat after me? Fish. 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 Rice. 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 Soup. Rice. Soup. Pickles. 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 Green tea. Green tea. Green tea. Very good. Okay. All right. And in Mexico, they have eggs. 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 Beans. 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 Tortillas. Tortillas. Fresh fruit. Fresh, fresh fruit. fruit. Fresh fruit. Sweet bread. Fresh. Sweet bread. Sweet bread. Sweet bread. Sweet bread. Sweet bread. Mm -hmm. bread, bread. And coffee with milk. Coffee with milk. Yeah. Very good. Okay. All right. Now, what about you? What do you have for breakfast? Now, don't tell me. Don't tell me yet. Okay. But I want you to think. What a t what what sorry what food do you have for breakfast? Write it down in your in your notebook. Write down what do you have for breakfast? Okay? And if you have questions about vocabulary, you can ask me. One word that I know is going to come up is this one. I'm going to write in chat. Okay, so I wrote in the chat a word. The word is plantain. Do you know what plantain is? Plantain. plantain. What is plantain? I don't know. Any idea? No, I don't have any idea. No? Plantain. No mm -hmm. Exactly. So I'm pretty sure you're going to be using that word. Okay, so um, eh, I want you to eh, write right now what what uh, food do you have for breakfast? Okay, so I'll give you about one minute to write down the things that you'll have for breakfast. No, 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 
Okay, are you finished? If you have questions, you can ask me. Remember, always ask, how do you say? And you said the word in English, right? Okay? So I'm writing in the chat. How do you say? And then they said the word in English. So for example, how do you say platanos in English? So I would say, you say plantain. Mm -hmm. Okay, are you finished? Yes? Yes. Okay, perfect. All right, so now I want you to think about lunch. What do you have for lunch? What is lunch? More. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So think about what do you have for lunch? Remember, you can always ask if you don't know how to say something. Okay, and now the last question is, what do you have for dinner? Okay, so think about what do you usually have for dinner?
You don't need any help with the vocabulary? Este, para decir tamales es okay. igual, lo mismo. Okay, ask, remember, ask me in English. Ah, uh, este, um, <laughs> how do you say tamales in English? Yeah, you, it's the same, except that you pronounce it tamales, but you, you spell it the same. Same spelling? Tamales. Yeah, in the pronunciation is tamales. Don't ask, me, and... don't ask me why. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> eh, pupusas. It's the same because that okay. is a pro it's a proper name. Pupusas. Pupusas. Mm -hmm. okay. it's, a, it's a proper name. It's, it's un nombre propio. So it doesn't change. Okay. Okay. Okay, are you finished, everybody? Finished or no? No, yet. Not yet? Douglas, are you finished? Yes. Okay, wonderful. Excellent. All right. Guillermo, are you finished? Yes. Yes. Okay. And Teresa? Yes. Okay. Raul, too? Raul, are you there? Raúl se encuentra allí. Yes. Okay, perfect. Are you finished? Yes. Okay. Yes, finished. Good. Okay. So what we're going to do is I'm going to put you into um, small groups. Okay. So we're going to divide the class into two groups. And you're going to tell your partner what you have for breakfast, what you have for lunch, and what you have for dinner. So you're gonna be asking them, what do you usually have for, for breakfast? What do you usually have for lunch? What do you usually have for dinner? And then you're going to tell your partner about your, your meals of the day. Do we understand what to do? Is that pretty clear? Or do you have any questions? Bench. It's clear? Yes. Yes. Perfect. For din yeah, so yeah, so you say for lunch, for dinner, uh, for breakfast. And then you say, I have, I have, blah, blah, blah. I can, I can write in the chat. All right. Uh, let me write in the chat. Ask me in English, please. Perdón? Ask me in English. Preguntan en inglés. How do you say avocado? En inglés. Uh -huh. mm, how do you say 
English aguacate? How do you say aguacate in English? You say avocado. 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 Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. okay. So you can say for breakfast, I have. For lunch, I have. For dinner, I have. Okay. And I wrote in the chat. Okay. So mm -hmm. I'm going to put you in breakout rooms. Um. Disculpen, chicos, que no sé, no sé por qué estoy teniendo ahí un problemitas con el Zoom. Y no sé por qué no me da la opción de los breakout rooms. Deme un momentito para averiguar qué está pasando acá. Ok. Creo que hoy sí. Okay. Um, all right. So I'm going to open the rooms right now. Oh, eh, por cierto, Fabricio, hágame un favor. En la plataforma sí. solo, solo aparece como Fabricio Guido. Hágame el favor de cambiar su nombre completo para nombre completo. Sí, sí. Okay. Thank you. All right. I'm opening the rooms right now. Raúl. Raúl. ¿Se escucha? Yeah, what do you have for breakfast? Sí, what do you have? What do you have for breakfast? Breakfast. I have an eggs, a coffee. A beans, tortillas, sweet bread, coffee, or coffee with milk, cream and cheese. Okay, and what do you want do you have for for lunch? I have fish, rice, or maybe chicken soup, tortillas, orange juice. Um, that's it. And what do you have for dinner? I have an eggs, beans, cream, cheese, sweet bread, coffee, or coffee with milk, tortillas. That's it. Okay. And you, what do you have for breakfast? For breakfast, I have a plantain, scrambled eggs, cream, beans, and bread. Okay. That's what do you have for lunch? For lunch, I have uh, some rice, fresh salad with lemon, uh, roast meat, Two tortillas and mango juice. All right. That. What do you have for dinner? Uh, for dinner, I have uh, one pupusa, one tamal, and a stereo with tomatoes, 
and bread and a cup of coffee. Very good. Fabrizio, remember it's tamale. Right. Tam tamale. Tamale. Mm -hmm. Correct. Tamale. Yes. Tamale. tamale. Juan Tamale. Eh, una pregunta. <laughs> eh, yes. How do you say dos panes? I can say you dos can say panes. Two, two, two pieces of bread. Two pieces of bread. Yeah. Dos, dos, pies, dos, oh, okay. uh -huh, dos pieces de pan. Mm -hmm. Okay, so two pieces of bread. Thank you. Mm, you're welcome. Este, ahora, Raúl. Sweet, sweet, eggs, coffee, and pupusa. Mm -hmm. Si quiere, le voy a hacer una pregunta yo. Eh, what do you usually have for breakfast? Eso es lo que yo había escrito, te voy a responder acá. Dice, Dice I like to have break for dinner when avocado, avocado and tortilla. Pero te lo voy a escribir. You can, you can say tortillas. Mm -hmm. You can say tortillas. You can continue. Si quiere Douglas en lo que le escribe Guillermo la respuesta. Le hago la pregunta yo a usted. Ok. Ok. What do you have for lunch? What do you usually have for lunch? For lunch, I have rice, soup, tortillas, chicken, lasaña, salad, fish, and pizza. Ok, good. What do you usually have for breakfast for breakfast i have eat cream bread and coffee okay guillermo what do you ¿Sí? usually have for lunch uh, i like to eat finish finish beef rice and selling for lunch. Okay. What do what do you have for lunch? For lunch, I have soup, chicken, and fish, pizza. Okay. Are you finished? Everybody has a chance to to talk about what you what you have for everybody finished? Yeah? What you have for lunch, what you have for dinner, what you have for breakfast? Yes? Yes. Yeah. Okay, good, good, good. All right. So um all right, so what we're going to do now 
is actually, you know what? I would like to hear what you guys have for breakfast. So let me ask Teresa. Teresa, what do you have for breakfast? For breakfast, I have eggs, cream, bread, and coffee. Sorry, could you hear it? Can you repeat that again? Eggs. 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 Sorry. Mm -hmm. That's Eggs. Okay. Cream. Mm -hmm. Bread. Mm -hmm. And coffee. Perfect. Okay. Very good. All right. Pedro, what do you have for breakfast? Uh, an eggs. A coffee. Beans. Tortilla, sweet bread, coffee, cream, and cheese. Okay, very good. I have a question. Do you how many eggs do you eat? A one. Okay. So in that case, you just say an egg, no s. An egg. An egg. No. Mm. Perfect. An egg. Very good. Thank you. Okay, Raúl. What do you have for lunch? For lunch, mm -hmm. with chicken, rice, salad, fruit, juice, or lemonade. Okay, very good. Excellent. Guillermo, what do you have for lunch? Uh, sorry, Guillermo, uh, can you turn on the microphone? Okay, perdón. Mm -hmm. No, it's okay. Uh, fish, mm -hmm. beef, mm -hmm. rice, and salad. Okay, and salad. And salad. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Douglas, what do you have for dinner? For dinner, I have beans, squeezed bread, coffee with milk, avocado, eggs, and pupusa. Okay, very good. Very good. And um, just be careful, it's avocado, not kato, kato. Avocado. avocado. Mm -hmm. Good. Okay. Excellent. Fabrizio, what do you have for dinner? For dinner, I have one pupusa, mm -hmm. uh, one tamale, a stereoed with tomato, and two pieces of bread and a cup of coffee. What did you say with tomato? Tomato. Yeah. Stereoed with tomato. Stereoed. With salt. Stary. Stary. Stary is stary. Mm -hmm. I'm not... no. Oh, you're talking about eggs. Are you talking about eggs? Um, eggs. Yeah. Okay. All right. So you're you're saying huevos estrellados? Un huevo estrellado, is yes. that what you're saying? Ah, okay, okay. No problem. Uh, you we say um egg sunny side up. That's what it's called. Egg sunny side up. Egg sunny side up. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. And I have mm -hmm. uh egg sunny side up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. With egg tomato. Yeah, exit inside up is cuando se estrella el huevo y, <coughs> y eh, queda la, la yema eh, intacta, ¿verdad? Que, que, que está, eh, que, que se mira la ruedita, Pierna. ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. That's exit mm -hmm. inside up. Mm -hmm. Okay, gracias. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Okay, very good. Excellent, guys. Very, very good. Okay, let's move on to the next part. Um, please tell me if you can see the conversation.
Yes, can you see the conversation? Yes, no? Yes. Okay, good. Yes. Yes. All right, very good. Okay, I want everybody to practice with me. Let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Let's have... Everybody, let's have let's breakfast have... together on Sunday. Let's have breakfast together on Sunday. Sunday. Okay. 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 Come to my house. Come to, Come to my house. house. Come to my, my house. My family always. My family, my family, family always. always has a Japanese style breakfast. Has a Japanese style <laughs> breakfast on <laughs> Sundays. Breakfast. 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 Right, eight first. Right, yeah. Is that, yeah, on Sundays? On Sunday. On Sunday. Sunday. Really? What do you have? Really? What do you have? We usually have fish. We usually have fish. Right. Rice and Rice. soup. Rice and soap. Fish for breakfast? Fish for, for breakfast. breakfast? That's interesting. That's, That's interesting. interesting. So this word here, you do not pronounce it interesting. It's not interesting. It's interesting. 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 Good. So it's a in tres teen. Three syllables. In Good. In interesting. Interesting. Yes. Very good. Interesting. Sometimes we have a salad. Sometimes we have a salad. Two. 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 Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we always, and we, we always have green tea. Have green tea. Have green tea. Well, I never eat fish. Well, I never I eat any fish. fish. For breakfast. For breakfast. But I like to try new things. But, but I, I like, like to try new things. Mm -hmm. I like to try new things. But I like to try new things. Good. Do you have any questions about the vocabulary? No question. No? OK. No question. OK. All right, so I'm no. going to ask people to help me read. So maybe Guillermo and Raul, you can help me read. Guillermo, you can be Sarah. And Raul, you can be Kumiko. OK. OK. <clears throat> Uh, um, let's have breakfast. Do do have three on Sunday? Okay. Come to my house. My family always it has a Japanese style breakfast on Sunday. Really? What do you have? We usually have fish, fry, and soap. Fish for breaking fat. Uh, this interesting. Sometimes we had a salad too, and we always 
hit hub green tea. What e high nail and pitch is for breakfast? Wolf high like to drink new drinks. Okay, bravo. Very good. Excellent, guys. Okay. All right. Um, okay, so I'm going to write in the chat a few words. Okay, so this first word we say together. 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 Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Um, another word is okay, so we're gonna practice again this word. I know it's not easy, right. but we're gonna practice it. It's in trust teen. Interesting. 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 Very good. Okay. Interesting. Right. Yeah. And this it's word is try. 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 Twin. Twin. Y la última palabra. Twin. Sing. Oh, the, the, word, the last word is things. Thing. Things. Things. Mm -hmm. things. 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 Yes. Okay. Any questions? No questions. No questions. No? Okay. No. All right. Very good. Okay. So, um, I'm going to stop sharing because I'm going to um, share something else with you. Can you see my screen? Yes. 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 Okay. So here we're going to be talking about adverbs of frequency. What are adverbs of frequency? Adverbs of frequency are those words that um, they are the words that tell us how often or how frequent something happens. Those are adverbs of frequency. Okay, so they tell us if the activity that we're talking about happens very often or not very often. So if the activity that we're talking about happens 100% of the time, we use the adverb always. Not always, but always. Okay? Always. Can you repeat after me? Always. 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 Mm -hmm. Always. Very good. Okay. Now, if the activity happens 90% of the time, then we use the adverb usually. 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 Good. Usually. 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 Good. Usually. Usually. So do not say usually. It's not usually. It's you usually. Usually. You usually. 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 Good. Okay. If the activity that we're talking about happens. 80% of the time, then we can use the word normally or normally. generally. Or generally. Yeah. Generally. So repeat. Normally. Normally. Generally. 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 
generally generally yes generally generally okay no 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 listen generally generally good gen ra li generally yes so yeah. So that that e is actually silent. We don't pronounce really that e. It's not generally. It's gen re li. Gen yeah, gen generally. Yeah, the e generally. is silent. Okay? Good. All right, next. Generally in this is cas igual que usually Usually. usually. Yeah, yeah, it's a little bit less, but the same idea. Mm -hmm. The same idea. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Then we have when it's 70% of the time, then we can say often. 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 Okay. Also, Another way of pronouncing this word is often. 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 Yeah. So often is more like a American English. Often is more British English. But the two forms are acceptable. Okay. The two forms are okay. All right. Yeah. Questions? No? Okay. All right. Then we have the word frequently. 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 Mm -hmm. Very good. Frequently. Frequently. Yeah. Then we have. 50% at a time, we have the word sometimes. 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 Very good. Uh -huh. Okay, good. When it's 30% of the time, then we can say the word occasionally. 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 No, no. Listen. Occasionally. Occasionally. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Then we have the word, then if it's 10% of the time, we have the word seldom. 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 Mm -hmm. Very good. If it's 5% of the time, we can say the word rarely. 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 Okay. Another another word. A, another word that is not here, but can also be used. Actually, it's more, it would be more like here, like seldom. It's hardly ever. Hardly ever. Do you know hardly ever? What is hardly ever? Rara vez. Yeah. In, actually, it's more, no, not really. Rara vez is more rarely. Hardly ever? Casi. Huh? Sorry? Casi nunca. Casi nunca. Yeah, exactly. So that's more like right. seldom. Casi nunca. Okay. All right. Very good. And if it's 0% of the time, 
then we can say never. 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 Yeah. Can you repeat? Never. 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 Mm -hmm. Good. All right. Any questions? Do you have any questions, guys? No. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. I don't know what it means, seldom. Seldom is, it's like, it's very similar to hardly ever. Yeah, so okay. it's, it's the same idea. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. All right, any other questions? Um, So, it's like, seldom is like muy pocas veces. We can say muy pocas veces. This is, it's the same ideas. Casi nunca muy pocas veces, you know, kind of the same idea. All right, any other questions that you have? No questions. No? No? Okay. All right. Very good. Um, all right. Now let's take a look uh, at the position. So notice that, notice the position. I always wake up at six o'clock. Okay. I always wake up at six o'clock. I usually come home after work. I usually come mm -hmm. home after work. I normally swim after school. I normally swim after school. I often spend Christmas with friends. I often spend Christmas with friends. I sometimes play tennis on the weekend. I sometimes play oh, tennis so on the weekend. I occasionally eat Vietnamese food. I occasionally eat Vietnamese food. I seldom go to the library. I seldom go to the library. I rarely listen to the radio. I rarely listen to the radio. And I never listen to rock music. I never listen to rock music. Good. So I want you to notice the position. Notice this is the verb. Wake, come, swim, spend, play, eat, go, listen, and I can listen. Yeah. So what is the position? of the adverb of frequency. Where does it go? Hmm? Can you tell me the position? What is the position? Sorry? Can you repeat? Uh, between the, the soil and um, in the bear. Very good. Okay, excellent. We've moved to the subject or the verb, or simply said before the verb. Okay. Always put the adverb frequency before the verb. Okay. Before the verb. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Any questions? Mm -hmm. No? Okay. Very good. All right. I'm going to clear the, I'm going to clear this and I'm going to share in the WhatsApp group. Okay, just give me a moment while I share in the WhatsApp group.
Okay. Do you do you see it right now? I just sent it. Do you see it? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Yeah. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to um, be doing a few activities. Um, so I'm going to, um, I'm going to uh, share with you The activities that I want you to do in your, you're going to be working in groups and you're going to be doing the activities that I'm going to send you in the, in the, in the WhatsApp group as well. Okay. So right now, please tell me if you can see the activities three that I have sent you. Yes. You see it? You see it, guys, or you don't see it? Chicos, ¿lo ven o no lo ven? Cuéntenme. Sí. Yes? Yes. Okay, yes. perfect. Okay, so you're going to be going to breakout rooms and you're going to be working with a partner and you're going to be talking about, or you're going to be completing the exercises, okay? So right now I'm going to divide the class again into two groups. Second. Okay. Um, all right, so I'm gonna give you guys right now uh, about eight minutes to solve it. Okay, here we go. And I will. Hello, Raul. Hello, Raul. Yeah. Eh, bueno, ya comprendiste más o menos qué es lo que vamos a hacer. Exactamente, tenemos que completar la parte B, ¿verdad? Ajá. Mm, vale. Entonces, bueno. Eh... O sea, que tenés bueno. que ordenar las oraciones, porque ahí ya están. Sí, ajá, cabal, porque sí están bien desordenadas. Eh. Desayuno en nunca... So in the first in the first activity is you have to just add the adverb of frequency in the first activity. Just add it, just insert. Insert in the correct place. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. In the first activity, insert, insert the cor the word in the correct place place in the sentence. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Um, 
Number two eh, sería entiendo que va a ir según lo que dijo antes del verbo. Ajá, antes del verbo. Entonces es I usually I have usually o I usually have. No, no usually, but usually. Usually. Correct. La primera no sabe nada. La primera es. Ah, este. I know. Have great for own. Entonces, la, la, la segunda sería. Well, I usually have coffee, cereal, and juice. No sé si es así o cómo es. Mm, pero sin el usually. El often. El, el, el usually va a ir en la pregunta, entonces. Ajá, exacto. Sí, pues en, el, en la B no íbamos a ir en la torre. Well, I often have así coffee, como, cereal, and juice. Así sería. Así, así o sea, como estaba haciendo, como nos puso las preguntas ahí hey, hace rato. Sí, porque este, la, okay. las indicaciones dice poner el adverbio en la... En, en el lugar correcto dice. Ah, ya te entendí. Entonces el usually lo vamos a poner en el lugar que debe de ir, el open en el lugar que debe de ir, ever, así. Y entonces es what do you usually have for breakfast? Sí, yo digo que quizás así ha de ir porque sí, va después del pronombre ¿no? uh -huh. y antes del verbo. Así está la pregunta que ella nos estaba haciendo hace rato. Sí, así está es. antes del verbo, va que sí. Sí. Okay. sí. Entre el you y el have. Y el have. Entonces la pregunta oh, quedaría, no. what do you usually have for breakfast? La respuesta mm. sería, well, I have, no, I, I often have coffee. Cereal en juice. Cereal, ajá, sí. Next question. La siguiente. Ajá. Uh, do you ever eat breakfast at work? Sí, así creo que sí. But do you ever eat uh, así? Ajá, sí, do sí. Ever, uh -huh. Do you ever eat? La siguiente, I sometimes have breakfast. Sometimes, sí, sería. al principio también, ¿verdad? Ajá, sería I. De las dos formas. Sometimes. Sí. ¿Cómo? 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 Sometimes. I often. Sometimes. I have breakfast at my desk. O I sometimes have breakfast at my desk. I, I often. La respuesta sería Do Ajá, you usually eat rice for breakfast? Uh -huh. no, esa es la pregunta. Do you usually eat rice? Ajá. Sí, tendría que ir después del I. La última. No, I hardly ever have rice. Yo, no, quizás así va. <ríe> sí, así, por lo que... Así va. Continuamos con el, con el B. Uh -huh. La otra dice que hay que ordenarlo. Okay. Las oraciones. Uh -huh. Ordenar las oraciones. oraciones. Ajá, y hay que ponerlas en el orden, ¿correcto? El orden. Ahí nos da el ejemplo, el número uno. I never had breakfast on weekends. Mm. Mm. Siguiente. I hardly ever, hardly ever work. Eat, it's not Eat work. at work. Eat at work. Uh -huh. Eat at La tercera sería... 
I, I sometimes, sometimes eat, eat for pasta. For dinner. I sometimes eat pasta for dinner. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. For dinner, uh -huh. The number four, I often have dinner with with my family. Oh, see. Dinner with my family. Uh-huh. Are you free? I have breakfast. It is a I so me some something I something have breakfast at my no te lo comas todo uh -huh. Do you usually in rice for breakfast? Uh -huh. Are we finished? Almost finished? Yes. 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 Yes, you're finished or you're almost finished? Yes, finished. Yes, you're finished? Yes. Yes. Ya terminaron. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Perfect. All right. I'll see you in the main room in a moment. Uh huh. Hoy vamos con la B. Ajá. La B. Va en el Q. I hardly, I, I hardly ever eat a snack at work. Aquí, ajá. Hi, every have breakfast with on webcam. Uh. Uy, bo. aquí sí ya me, algo me topé. En la segunda, pues, en, la, en el número dos de la. Ah, primera. perdón, la segunda, Eva, sí, sí. Um, hi, I hardly, hurry, ever, ever, ain't at work. Ajá, sí, cabal. Yo nunca hago así, va. Vaya, en la tree. I sometimes eat pastas for dinner. Mm -hmm. For dinner. For dinner. Yeah, for dinner. I sometimes eat pastas for dinner. 
Yes. Okay. No, I summon. No. I often have dinner with my family. Dinner. Dinner. Uh, I often. Dice <laughs> Basiva. I, I often have, have dinner with my, my family. family. Dinner. I often have dinner with my family. Yeah. Uh -huh. Bye. Okay, you're finished, right? Finished. Yeah. Okay, see you in the main room. What? Okay. All right, class, we're going to check our answers. So please tell me if you can see it. See my, my screen. Can you see my screen? Yes. Okay. Yes. Wonderful. Okay, so the first one says, Put the adverbs in the correct place, then practice with a partner. So the first one says, what do you usually have for breakfast? Well, I have coffee, cereal, and juice. Where does the word often go? Where do we put this word often? I Often. Mm -hmm. I often have. Good. I often have um, coffee, cereal, and juice. I'm just going to put it there because that way you know you should go right there. Next. Do you eat breakfast at work? Where do you put the word ever? Do you ever eat breakfast at work? Excellent. We say. Do you ever eat breakfast at work? Next. I have breakfast at my desk. I sometimes have I breakfast some... at my desk. Good. I sometimes have breakfast, have breakfast at my desk. At my desk. Okay. But, ojo con esto. The, the adverb of frequency sometimes is special. Si quieren podemos apagar todos los micrófonos porque quiero explicar algo importante. Y para que no hayan interferencias y todos escuchemos perfecto. Thank you. Okay, so sometimes is 
an adverb of frequency that is special. And the reason why it's special is because it's the only adverb of frequency that can that it's possible, not necessary, but possible to go at the beginning. So we could say sometimes like this. Sometimes I have breakfast at my at my desk. Okay, so this is a special case. It's a let's say it's a irregular. It's irregular um, adverb of frequency because it's the only one that it's possible to put at the beginning. So you can say sometimes I have breakfast at my desk, or I sometimes have breakfast at my desk. Do we understand? Is it pretty clear? Yes. Yes? Is that pretty yes. clear for everybody? Yes. Yes. Okay, perfect. All right, let's continue then. Um, do you eat rice for breakfast? No, do you usually eat rice for breakfast? Good. Do you usually eat rice for breakfast? Do you usually eat rice for breakfast? Good. And the last one. No, I have rice. No, I hardly ever have rice. Good. I hardly ever. I hardly ever have rice. Good. Bravo. Excellent. Okay. Now let's do the next one. Okay. Work, I snacks, eat uh, at hardly ever. What is it? I hardly, I hardly ever eat at work. I hardly ever eat. Eat? Eat, not eat. Eat. Snack. At work. Eat. Snack. Snacks. At work. At work. Good. I hardly ever eat snacks at work. Good. Okay. Excellent. Now, um, let's go on to the next one. Number three. I sometimes eat pastas for dinner. I sometimes eat pasta for dinner. Okay, good. Remember, another possibility is? What Sometimes is the... I eat pasta for dinner. Excellent. Very good. Sometimes? Oops. Perdón, perdón. Dinner. I eat and I have. Okay, so the two forms are possible. Good. And the last one? No, I often have with my family dinner. My family. With my family. I often have dinner with my family. Wonderful. Very good. Any questions about this? Any questions? No questions? No. No question. Okay. All right. I'm going to stop sharing. And please tell me if you can see my screen again. Yes. Yes. Okay. So we have these questions here about breakfast, lunch, and dinner. 
So you can ask your partner, do you usually eat breakfast? Do you usually eat lunch? Do you usually eat dinner? What time do you usually eat breakfast? What time do you usually eat lunch? What time do you usually eat dinner? Do you, do you ever eat meat for breakfast? Do you ever eat meat for lunch, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So you're gonna be asking your partner these questions, only the six questions. You don't need to ask more questions, just these ones right here, okay? Do we understand? Do you understand the questions? Yes. Yeah? Do you have any questions you want to ask me? Do you have any questions you want to ask me? Okay. All right. So what I'm going to do then is I'm going to be sending you these questions in the WhatsApp group. Just a moment. Okay, I'm sending the, the questions right now. Okay, and um, yeah. Okay, so here we go. I'm going to um, open the groups. I'm going to, or yeah, we're going to make small groups uh, working in pairs, and you can ask your partner the questions. Okay, are you ready? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Let's open the groups. Guillermo? Guillermo, are you having problems to get in? Guillermo, Fabricio? Hello? Chicos?
¿Dónde se comen? En la segunda. Uh -huh. What time do you usually eat? Ah, uh, what time do you usually eat breakfast? Tiempo. Por ejemplo, ajá, el tiempo. ¿A qué uh -huh. hora come el desayuno? ¿A qué hora come el almuerzo? ¿Y a qué hora come la cena? Y el otro, la tres, sería Do you ever eat, eat meat for... Um, Esa sí no la entiendo. Que nunca es como si comes que... carne para, mm. el, para el desayuno, para el almuerzo y para la cena. Okay. Es como no, si comes... Sí. Es como si... No sé, es que no me da el tiempo. Si alguna vez comes carne para... Para el desayuno, almuerzo o cena. Ajá. La otra sí entiendo que es que si va al restaurante para comer. Ajá. Sí. Sí, ¿verdad? Ajá. La de abajo es que usualmente bebe. Ajá, correcto. Y la última dice que. La pregunta es, ¿sueles comer nada más algo así o sueles comer? Sometimes, yes. Okay, but remember, the idea is to this ask the question. So you, uh -huh. so you have to ask each other the question and answer. Uh, what is sometimes do you ever eat for breakfast, lunch, and dinner? Sería como lo que tú nunca comerías. Uh -huh. Ajá. Por ejemplo. Para el ajá. breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Por ejemplo, digamos, pescado. ¿va? El pescado para el desayuno sería como algo raro. Ajá. Uh -huh. Igual que lo del okay. el párrafo anterior que estábamos escuchando. Yo uh -huh. sería como, digamos, I never eat, I never eat uh, fish for, for breakfast. Uh -huh. Es como que lo que, lo que uh -huh. nunca comerías. Uh -huh. Ajá. Es, que, es que si ustedes se fijan en, en el temita que está en la parte superior de derecha. Ok, izquierda, entonces, dice como, si quiere ah, comienzo yo. Va, yo. Entonces, mm. si la primera. Do you usually, usually eat? eat? ¿Qué, ¿Qué come? ¿Qué usualmente come? Usually eat? Eat? Yes, I, I usually no, eat. No, no, no. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Okay. Remember, it's usually, not usually. Usually. Sorry, I don't forget. You, you, usually. Usually. Mm -hmm. Right. Okay. Again, me olvida esa S. Se me olvida la pronunciación de esa S. Bye. Okay. Do you use do you usually eat breakfast, lunch, and dinner? Ahí, ah. esa ahí queda. Sí. Okay. What time do you usually eat? Uh, I usually eat my breakfast 9 a.m. Las nueve, nine a.m. Then I usually eat my lunch at uh, one p.m. I usually eat my dinner seven at night. Okay. Do you ever eat meat for? Uh, I ever eat meat for lunch or dinner? Okay. Do you ever go to Do you ever go to a restaurant for for lunch? For lunch. Okay. Uh huh. 
Uh, I I ever go to the restaurant for lunch. Okay. What do you usually drink for? Uh, usually, I usually drink for my breakfast coffee. For mm -hmm. my for my lunch, uh, water or soda. I usually drink for my dinner, coffee, coffee. Okay, very good, Pedro. Just just remember, you you have to say I usually drink coffee for my for my dinner, or for dinner. Okay, so I put usually... put put the dinner at the end. Okay. Oh yeah. All right. I usually, I usually drink, I usually drink coffee for dinner. That's correct. Okay. What is sometimes you never eat for? Um, I never. At. Six p.m. Do you have eight meat for? Are you finished? Do you are number number three? Uh, do you ever meet some jazz bear? Repeat the question, please. Uh, number three. Uh, bueno, la respuesta sería en la número tres. Sí, nada más, ¿verdad? O no. Are we finished? No. No? No. Okay, so guys, I don't want you to write so much. I just want you to speak. The idea is speaking. Speak as much as possible. Show me dinner, show me dinner. Man. Yeah. Or this is to ever go to the restaurant 
restaurant for breakfast? Uh, some dinner. Para mí la respuesta es summer dinner. A veces. ¿Te parece? It? Can you repeat that again? Sometimes. Sometimes. A restaurant for breakfast. Sometimes. 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 Mm -hmm. Sometimes. Mm -hmm. What do you usually do for red pasta? What do you usually drink for red pasta? I never drink for breakfast. Okay. What is some Sometimes you never eat for breakfast. What is something you never eat for breakfast? What is something? Drink. Alguien sabe que para que sueles beber o que sueles beber algo así. Coffee. The number five. Number five. Uh, yeah. Coffee. Uh, high coffee porque. Porque. O cuál suele ser tu bebida. Algo así va. Drink. What you usually ah, okay, Ajá, ¿qué bebes usualmente? Algo así. ¿O qué sueles beber? ¿Qué sueles beber? Uh -huh. Coffee, coffee. Number six. What is something you never eat for lunch? Never. ¿Por qué a veces nunca comes? ¿O por qué a veces no comes? Algo así, ¿ves? Creo que es algo que nunca has comido para el almuerzo. Algo que nunca hayas comido. Algo que nunca hayamos comido para el almuerzo. Bueno. Okay, are we finished? Yeah. Okay. All right, guys. Um, now let's take a look at this vocabulary here. Okay. And the first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna be talking about the seasons. Okay. So Let's start with this season here. Okay, it says in spring people play golf. What is spring? Who knows what is spring? Spring. 
What is spring? Mm -hmm. Primavera. Primavera, exactly. Mm -hmm. Very good. All right. Um, what about summer? In summer, people play baseball, tennis, they play tennis, play volleyball, and go swimming. What is summer? Verano. Verano, exactly. Very good. It says, in the fall, people play football, go bike riding, go hiking. What is the fall? Go. Caer. Yeah. Yes, uh, okay, right, okay. So, yes, it is caer, but when we're talking about seasons, we're talking about otoño, because why do you call fall, well, why do you call otoño fall? Because in, in otoño, la razón es porque en otoño caen las, um, las, Uh, las hojas mm -hmm. las hojas de los árboles okay that's why it's called fall okay another another word for fall is autumn okay autumn and you okay. fall yeah so you can of, say you can say people, people. Uh, fall or you can say autumn. The two forms are correct. Autumn. Okay. Yeah. Very good. Okay. So fall or autumn. What is, so then we have, in the winter, people play hockey, play basketball, go ice skating, go skiing. What is winter? Invierno. Invierno. Right. Okay, invierno. Excellent. Yeah. Bien. Invierno. Okay, good. Um, any questions about that? No, no questions. No? No questions? Yo, yo, yo sí, yo, por ejemplo, eso que explicó. Eh, del 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 far del auto mm -hmm. o sea, no le no comprendí que por qué eh, eh, cómo que por qué porque o sea eh, esa palabra auto qué quiere decir autumn autumn is the same thing as mm -hmm. fall it's the same so autumn Fall and autumn mean the same thing. They're, they're synonyms. Autumn. Fall, autumn oh, is the same. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Any other yeah. words that you don't understand? Yeah. No? Yeah, no. Okay. All right, very good. Okay, now let's talk about the vocabulary about sports. So we have in the spring, people play golf. We understand golf? Golf. golf. Yeah, we understand golf? golf. What, yeah, golf. okay. Golf. Yeah, like golf. yeah, right, okay. Um. Yeah, exactly. Uh, Good. In the spring, people play soccer. We understand soccer? Football. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, football. exactly. Football. Except that, yeah, we in in um, in American English we say soccer, not football. Okay? okay. All right. In the summer, people play baseball. You understand baseball? Yeah, basketball. baseball, good. In the summer, basketball. people play basketball. tennis. Uh, Do tennis. we understand tennis? Baseball. 
Yeah. We understand tennis. Tennis. Uh, tennis. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Very good. Um. Then we have in the summer people play volleyball. You understand volleyball? Volleyball. 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 Yeah. Yeah. You understand volleyball? Volleyball. Yes. Volleyball. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Good. Um. Okay. In we have in the in the fall people play football. What is football? American. Uh -huh, exactly. Yeah. Here we're talking about eh, no football del que ustedes um conocen normalmente, sino que sería football americano. Good. Okay. In the fall, people go bike Wind. riding. What does it mean go bike riding? Montar bicicleta. Mm -hmm. Montar a bicicleta. Exactly. Okay. Any questions about that? Any questions? No? No. Okay. Very good. In the fall, people go hiking. What is hiking? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Senderismo. Yeah, exactly. All right. Everybody understands hiking? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Good. In, in the winter, people play hockey. What is hockey? Hockey. 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 Player hockey. What is hockey? Hockey. Hockey. What is hockey? Mm -hmm. What is hockey? Parecido al fútbol, pero con un disco. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, we can say that. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay, so hockey is usually played on ice. Okay. Then we have. Yeah. yeah. And then we have in the winter, people play basketball. Basketball. Yeah. Baloncesto. Basketball. Exactly. Basketball. Yeah. And we do not say, we don't say basket. Okay. In, in Spanish, uh, many times to make it short, you say basket. Vamos a jugar basket, but not in English. We never say, let's go play basket. We say, let's go play a basketball. Has to be complete. Okay. And last one. Okay. In the winter, people go ice skating. Ice skating. Ice skating. Mm -hmm. What is ice skating? Good. Patinaje sobre hielo. Exactly. And finally, in the, in the winter, people go skiing. Go skiing. Yeah. Yeah. Skier. Exactly. Mm, exactly. Yeah. Skier. Okay. Any questions about that? No. No questions? No questions. No. Are you sure? Yes. Sure. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Very good. Now I just want you to notice one last thing. In most of these, we use the word play, play golf, play soccer, play, play bas baseball, play tennis, play oh, play volleyball, play football. Play hockey, play basketball. Y me acabo de dar cuenta que se nos había quedado una. Get up, go swimming. What is swimming? Nadar. Nadar. Nadando. 
Vamos a nadar. Natación. Nadar. Natación. Mm -hmm. Okay, so. And so we say play golf, play soccer, play baseball, play basketball, uh, sorry, play tennis, play volleyball, play football, play hockey, play basketball. But then some of them, some use go. So we say go bike riding, go hiking, go swimming, go ice skating, go skiing. ¿Alguien sabe la diferencia? Hago. ¿Mm? ¿Alguien sabe la diferencia? Va a ser. ¿Mm? What? Ir como ir, ir a patinar sobre el hielo, ir a esquiar. Okay, yeah. So play, we use play when the verb, sorry, when, when the action is uh, for a game that is competitive. Okay. So when we have a game that you are going to compete two people or two teams, we play, okay? Mm -hmm. So we, we play golf, we play soccer, we play baseball, play tennis, play volleyball, play football, play hockey, play basketball. We are having, we're competing. But go is usually a sport that is we do outside and it's not really to compete, okay? It's just to do exercise, like go bike riding. Mm -hmm. para montar a bicicleta, no vamos, no montamos a bicicleta para, para competir. It's just, it's just exercise, okay? Go hiking, go swimming, um, go ice skating, go skiing. Okay, these are just sports that you usually do for fun, not competition. Do okay. we understand the difference? Yes. yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay, yes. very good. Okay, so um, that's it, guys. I'm just going to take attendance then. Okay, let's uh, take our attendance. Um, okay, eh, so we have eh, Carlos Armando. Carlos Armando. Tú vienes Enrique Genoves. Sí. Eduardo Alexander Alvarado. Eres Fernando Enríquez. Fabricio Leonardo Zavala. Gladys Mi Marina Luna. Gladys Marina Luna. Guillermo Enrique Acosta. Present. José Eduardo Cruz. José Eduardo Cruz. Leida Arminda Valladares. Leila Arminda Valladares. Eh, Pedro Miguel Rodríguez. Present. Ok, very good. Rafael Antonio Marroquín. Rafael Antonio Marroquín. Uh, Raúl Alfredo Castaneda. Raúl Alfredo Caso. Ok, good. Sana, Sara Beatriz Valencia. Susana Guadalupe Navas. Teresa de Jesús Pérez. Present. Okay. Y Wilmer Andrés Melara. Ok. Mm. Ok, perfecto. So, eh, chicos, um, hemos terminado la unidad 4. 
Entonces sí. necesito que ustedes también en la plataforma hayan terminado la unidad 4 para la próxima semana. Y ya empezamos a las 5, así que si ustedes quieren pueden también empezar ya con las 5. Y también acuérdense que la próxima semana tienen que haber completado las 5 y el examen final. Entonces yo que ustedes... Eh, iría avanzando en el examen final para que no les agarre la tarde, ¿verdad? Ya al final, no queremos que, que estén ahí corriendo, ¿verdad? Con todo al final. Entonces, eh, el examen final cubre las, las últimas unidades, que son creo que, si no me equivoco, como la unidad, como la cuatro, la 3, la 4, 5, entonces pueden ya desde ahorita empezar a hacer la uni, la, el examen final y empezar ya con la, la unidad 5, ¿ok? ¿Tenemos Bien. alguna preguntita que hacer antes que terminemos? No. ¿No? ¿Estás seguro? No. ¿Estás seguro? ¿No preguntas? No No preguntas. ¿Seguro, chicos? Yeah. Okay. All right. In that case, guys, that will be all. And I will see you guys next Monday. Okay. Para la última clase sería el próximo lunes. Okay. Okay. All right, guys. Take care. Perfect. See you next week. All right. Bye. Bye. Take care. Bye. Bye. Thank you, you too. Thank you.